Hello guys, myself Suvraj and today we are going to study about Indus Valley Civilization. After watching the video, if you have any queries or questions, you can comment on the video or you can mail me on yuvraj4326 at the rate gmail.com. Now I am going to start the video. Today we are going to study about Indus Valley Civilization. The word Indus Valley Civilization was first used by Sir John Marshall and it was given by Sir John Marshall. He used the term IVC, I means Indus, B means Valley and C means Civilization. Rai Bahadur Dayaram Sahni and Madhu Sarupwats. These two discovered Harappa and Rakhal Das Bandhupadhyay discovered Mohan Judaro. Sir John Marshall held both in their excavations as he was the Director General of India. As I told you, Sir John Marshall was the Director General of Archaeological Survey of India. Now you tell me the name of the founder of Archaeological Survey of India and the name of the father of Indian Archaeology. Who is the father of Indian Archaeology? Watch the video till the end to know the answer. Now, the Indus Valley Civilization was flourished on 3300 BCE and was declined on 1800 BCE on the banks of Indus River and its tributaries. It had advanced urban culture and well developed town planning. They lived in proper house, mud house, and they had a citadel and a lower city. They had a great architecture of their town. They had a great economic life. Their geographical footprints nowadays we have discovered 250 such sites. Uh, in Hindi, the industrial civilization is known as Sapt Sindhu Sabhita. It is because of it is established or it is flourished on seven rivers. It includes Indus, Ravi, Satluj, Bees, Bhoga, Chenav, and Ghaghar. As I told you, 250 such sites are now discovered. Hadappa and Mohan Judaro are the largest sites. As Hadappa is the largest site, it is known as Hadappan civilization also. And Indus Valley Civilization because it is established on Indus River. Shortugai is some other sites. I am saying the names. Shortugai is now in Afghanistan. Manda is now in Jammu. Ropar is the name of Punjab. Banavali and Rakhi Ghadi is the name of Haryana. Alamgirpur is now in Uttar Pradesh. Kali Bangal is now in Rajasthan. Chanudaro, Kot Dijan and Amri is in Pakistan. Sutkagandur is in Western Baluchistan and Lothal is in Gujarat. They extended their boundaries up to uh, Western Baluchistan, Sutkagandur in West, Alamgirpur, Uttar Pradesh in East, Madhu is the place in Jammu uh, in North and Lothal in Gujarat in East. Uh, later on they uh, uh, extended more in East up to Maharashtra also now I am showing some archaeological sites like Harappa on which river it is based on which river it is flourished and some archaeological importance what the archaeologist got on the place archaeological evidence Harappa is uh, stabilized on Ravi uh, and uh, the row of granaries and mother god was found. Harappa has the largest granary. Mohan Jodaro was on Indus river. It had a great bath, granary and uh, images and statues of Lord Pashupati and Mahadev beard man and a bronze woman dancer. Lothal which is on Bhogao river. Ropal is on Satluj river. Lothal we got Port City, Double Burial, Dockyard and Terracotta Houses, Kalibangan is on Ghagar and Plotted Field was found as archaeological evidence. Now we are going to talk about the architecture. As I told you, they had not great monuments, but their architecture was their city. See this city, this upper part is known as Saitadal. High Priest, this is the High Priest. He lived in the Saitadal and the food like different wheat and rice. Port city as I told you it is on Lothar, Gujarat. It was a port city. 
दे एड ट्रांसपोर्ट विथ सो मैनी अदर सिविलाइजेशन आर्किटेक्चर प्लान सिटी सी दिस ग्रेट बाथ इट हैड सिक्स एंट्रीज एंड इट शोज लाइक इट इज अ ग्रेट टैंक अ बिग टैंक इट सीम्स टू बी अ स्विमिंग पूल यूज फॉर रिलीजियस कल्चर्स एंड सो मैनी रिचुअल्स एंड सेक्रीफाइज सी द ब्रॉन्ज डांसर एज आई टोल्ड यू इन मोहन जुदारो आर्कियोलॉजिकल एविडेंस फॉर द ब्रॉन्ज डांसर अ ब्रॉन्ज वोमेन डांसर सी दिस ब्रॉन्ज वोमेन डांसर they had granaries great granaries uh the i am saying about the great granary it is in harappa it had two rows each row consist of six granaries and uh, the granary had 15 15.23 multiply by 6.09 meter each granary has a size of 15.23 meter multiply by 6.09 meter you can note this and it has six Uh, and now i am talking about great bath it had six entrance from here you can enter here and so many four entrances are more there it is a rectangular tank seems to like swimming pool now i am going to say saying the answer of the question which i asked alex gender cunningham he was the father of indian archaeology and the found he was the father of indian archaeology and the founder of archaeological survey of india he ex- he excavated about the buddhism culture he is uh, alexander cunningham excavated about buddhism history in 1837 he excavated sanchi and uh, in 1848 he excavated architectures in kashmir in 1850 he excavated sarnath and in 1854 he excavated ladakh he was the first director of archaeological survey of india he was in army and he retired as a major general in the british army thank you friends subscribe the channel like the video and share to all your friends so they can also gain the information